Hello students, this is Divya from bankexamstoday.com. Today I will be telling you some tips and some key points for the reading comprehension for RBI grade B exam. So students, let's see that quickly in this video. Now what like for RC passages, reading comprehension, uh, it is very important part for the descriptive paper and uh, although it is time consuming but uh, it is kind of a necessary evil like you have to attempt all the like questions for this and for scoring good okay for doing well like you must have reading habit i will suggest you you should read the articles and so that you can you have the habit of reading and so that you can quickly grab the key things for the like answers that will improve your performance right so uh, like what I expected topics can be there for RC reading comprehensions. So RC can be about uh, the social issues that are trending or uh, not trending about banking or taxation related to economy or some RBI uh, topics that can be there in the RC. So it, uh, it has to be it, uh, it will be based basically on these topics. Uh, there can also be some other topics that we can expect uh, but uh, the main uh, the frame in the frame of the topics mainly these uh, topics will be covered and uh, basically these topics for RCs or the articles issued in Kurushetra, uh, Kurushetra or Yojana magazines uh, they are from there or articles uh, issued in the newspapers uh, uh, all of these articles can come for the RCs okay so uh, students i'll be sharing uh, some key points also here for uh, you to easily understand the uh, like crack the rc thing so for that first of all you need to uh, it is the very important thing if you read the questions carefully and exactly what uh, the reader or the, the examiner is asking you okay so for that uh, like if you read the questions carefully you will, you will be able to give the answer appropriately right so to select the uh, like there are many questions that, that are there in which they write the opposite meaning that they need the opposite uh, meaning of the per some particular word rather than the similar meaning so uh, we pre-assume that uh, they have asked this so we just end up writing the wrong answer so for to avoid that uh, you must read the questions carefully and before reading the passage I would suggest you to re uh, read the questions first okay and then like uh, also you don't uh, panic or you don't uh, worry if you don't know the meaning like for vocabulary based questions if you don't know the meaning of uh, exact meaning of the uh, like uh, whatever the vocabulary based question that is asked just you, what you do read the passage uh, again and see that word is used in, in which context and then predict the meaning obviously we have that sense uh, when we read the passage we read the line uh, we get the context of the word that is used in it so accordingly we predict the answer and write we can write down that don't think that we don't know the meaning of this word and we will not attempt the question you can uh, easily uh, predict the meaning of the word if you don't in case you don't know the uh, word okay so easily predict it also for the uh, here is the important thing uh, like when you uh, when the question comes that uh, what does the author wants to convey in the article or what is the theme of the article for that what you can do you can read the first or the last paragraph of the passage uh, just you will get to know the gist of the passage what exactly the this article uh, who has written the article what the author wants to say so uh, these the questions like these you can easily write from that okay then also uh, like to you know uh, make the habit of reading uh, it is very important to, to uh, for the rc like uh, to get uh, to get the hold on the rc thing you should have the habit of reading and practice a lot online if you can do it in your uh, devices or the laptops so you will be able to uh, you will not feel awkward in the environment when you will be given the exam 
सो आई हैव द हैबिट ऑफ रीडिंग ऑनलाइन ओके एंड दैट विल हेल्प यू टू अंडरस्टैंड द पैसेज वाइल यू आर रीडिंग इन योर एट योर एग्जाम सो यू विल बी एबल टू फोकस ऑन योर पैसेज एंड नॉट यू नो योर यू विल नॉट बी डिस्ट्रैक्टेड बाई रीडिंग ऑनलाइन सो यू शुड हैव द हैबिट दैट्स मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट थिंग ओके so then uh, here are some tips that uh, you can uh, easily uh, like follow for uh, efficiently uh, attempting the asses okay so first of all i would suggest you to read the questions first okay reading the questions first give us the idea uh, like uh, then when while we are reading the passage we get to know that uh, we have read this question so answer might be related to this like that so if we read the questions first uh it gives it saves us time saves our time which is very important right so uh and after reading the question then you just read the passage and don't just read it just actively read it and focus on that a uh, particular thing okay uh you just don't give it a reading just actively read take part in everything what's happening in the passage what the passage the what the author is trying to say in the particular passage or something like that also at the same time don't rush while reading uh if you have the habit of reading fast that is fine but uh if you don't like if you are uh, like running out of time and you say that okay we'll read it if, uh like hurriedly and then you'll end up missing the main idea of the comprehension so that will be of no use then uh if you didn't understand something don't just go ahead reread it uh, reread it and then just summarize the paragraph in your mind okay whatever that you uh, are reading all the paragraphs one uh, one by one that you have read summarize that paragraph in your mind take some time with that not much but obviously just two or three seconds that what you have read and then uh, summarize it in your mind and then if if necessary you can also note down uh, some words or some key points or some uh, things okay which are important uh to the company which might uh, be like the answer might be related to that thing so which are important you can also write that uh, okay and when you are uh, writing your answers students most most of the students what they uh, do they copy the answer from the passage this is important thing to note down that do not copy answers from the passage this is very important uh if you want to score good just form an uh, idea of the passage and whatever the reader is asking uh, whatever the question the reader uh, this uh, sorry the examiner is asking so uh, just form an opinion and uh, like write down what the uh, they want to ask you what the answer they need in your own words so it is important write answer in your own words and not copy from the passage okay so this is important and then obviously lastly practice practice and practice as practice is very important for the exam uh, if you say that uh, i will able to crack the answer and write like that in exam it is not gonna help you at all you just need to practice it a lot okay so next is a kind of expected question what type of questions that you can expect from the uh, like uh, like in the rcs uh, it can be related to the theme of the article what exactly is article is about so you need uh, you might have to write the theme of the article like it is uh, for the like related to uh, what e economy or what the author is conveying in that or uh, like what is the tone of the author the uh, like what is the tone maybe you can write uh, it is and the author is informative being optimistic or uh, like submissive so all of these words so uh, you need to for the tone of the author uh, what is the tone of the author basically uh, it is what uh, the authors want to convey with the topic uh, with that passage or what author feels about the subject okay so that is what the tone of author is so you need to 
राइट अकॉर्डिंगली अकॉर्डिंगली एंड देन देर कैन बी वोकेबलरी बेस्ड क्वेश्चन एज वेल दैट इज जस्ट यू नो वोकेबलरी बेस्ड क्वेश्चन कैन बी लाइक सिमिलर वर्ड्स ऑपोजिट मीनिंग लाइक दैट राइट डाउन द वर्ड सिमिलर टू दिस वर्ड राइट डाउन द वर्ड ऑपोजिट ऑफ दिस वर्ड सो वोकेबलरी बेस्ड क्वेश्चन कैन ऑल्सो बी देयर देर कैन ऑल्सो बी क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू ट्रू एंड अनट्रू स्टेटमेंट्स लाइक फ्रॉम द पैसेज यू लाइक समथिंग लाइक दिस लाइक फ्रॉम द पैसेज वट डू यू फील दिस इज ट्रू अबाउट दिस पर्टिकुलर थिंग नॉट लाइक दैट and also what is the context of the passage what the what exactly the passage is about so all of these questions uh, are uh, just what uh, can be it is just it might be related to these uh, like kind but also there can be many other questions which is uh, like depends upon that depends upon what type of topic the rc is the rc has so uh i hope you understood whatever i wanted to tell also uh, at the uh, bank exams today we are giving the uh, this service for rbi grade b descriptive paper evaluation service uh, where our team of experts will be evaluating uh, your essays reading comprehensions and pressy writings and there will also be video lectures about it and uh, like Uh, along with reports will be given to you so you can uh, enroll for it definitely and uh, you know how to enroll for this if you want to enroll for this you can go to la- uh, learn.bankexamstoday.com or you can uh, install the mobile application as well uh, all the links for this is available in the description box down below so you can check that and uh, quickly enroll that because it is for limited students so go ahead and and for and roll for the course so that's all uh, for today students thank you very much for watching have a nice day bye bye